Joseph Williams clarifies the use of the Toto name. There's been a lot of debate on whether they're even allowed to use the name, but of course they're using it, so they must be allowed. But I asked him anyway. I'm John Bowden from Rocky Street Music. For you, like, what's the future look like beyond Toto? Uh, because, it, I mean, is it still being called Toto? Or is that just sort of... Yes, it's definitely called Toto. You know, I, I kind of, I'm the one that sort of calls us Dogs of Oz. Um, it's, it's, it's different than, than, than earlier incarnations of Toto because may, maybe there are less people from the original group or even from the period of time when, when, when I was in there. Um, but yes, it's still very much Toto. We're, we're playing those songs. The musicianship is, is, is up to par and above it the way it's always been with the, with the new guys. That's a prerequisite. Um, the vibe is, is great between the musicians and, and uh, it comes off, the, or, or the, this new band definitely comes off feeling wise, feeling wise very much the way the old one did you know what i mean the, you know the back the 80s version that, that i was in but um technically to answer your question yeah of course it's still toto as long yeah. as as long as steve look there's there and, and Paige is involved and 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 everything and i can still you know hobble myself out there and scream then yeah we can it's still toto with your brother how far back did you work with your brother musically my brother Mark, my mm -hmm. my yeah. my actual brother. Yeah. Um, geez, musically, I back <laughs> five or six, I guess. Five or six years old. Is he younger or older? He's he's two years older. And was was he introducing you to music while you were growing up? Um, well, it, the whole house was musical. My dad was working and playing the piano. My mother was a singer and, you know, trying to get roles and films and things like that. And my brother started playing the drums and guitar. So every, you know, he took cello for a while. I took piano for a while. It was, you know, sort of like what the, what it was like in the, in the house. So he marked it necessarily introduced me to music, but we start we started, I mean, technically, if you want to, if you want to, Put it this way we started playing together when when he was probably seven or eight and i was five or six something something like that not for real but i mean just you know playing around and, and trying to trying to play our, our instruments together was and was that encouraged or is just a thing you did i mean that's just a thing you did right no it was always encouraged or or at the very least never never discouraged you know when uh, i don't know if i asked you the the dentist office question last time I don't remember because when I leave my interviews, it's like what you were saying a while ago, Chase edits them, puts them together, and I don't see them again, right? Right. Because I have to move to the next thing because I immerse myself so much in this. If you're in the do a dentist's office and someone says, what do you do? Do you open that door? What do you do? If someone says, hey, so what do you do? And, you know, it's sometimes I do. It's, it's sometimes you, sometimes you, you, can't, uh, you can't help but get into it. Uh, uh, most of the time, because I want to answer honestly, and I say, I'm a, I'm a musician. You know, do you know or, anything? Would have you done anything? I would know. Always exactly. the next question. And then, and then, usually there's a next question. And it's literally, it's mostly just to make conversation. And so, you know, it's sometimes it's very difficult to go. Uh, well, I'm just a, a, you know, a musician. You know, I'm. It's it's difficult for me when they when they say, yeah, what have you done? Have you, what have you worked on? I got to, you know, what am I going to tell? What am I going to say? I say I, I usually tell people I'm in an I'm in an. Uh, uh, a, a rock band from the eighties that was very successful back then. I tell yeah. people sometimes, and then of course, which band and you know, we'll have another clip with Joe Williams in three, four days. Make sure you comment on our videos. We say this, but spread the word. We're almost at a hundred thousand subscribers. Share our videos on the total groups or on the classic rock groups or any groups you're in on your Facebook page, on your Twitter, help us spread the word. Comment on our videos, subscribe to that channel, and buy a t-shirt. Links in the description. I'm John Bowden. This is Rock History Music.